my issues. That is, uh, uh, my face cannot show at the bottom of the screen when I open my PowerPoint. I don't know why. And uh, I find uh, four people to help me solve this problem. And one of them is a uh, IT professional IT guy. He connect my laptop and check my internet and uh, my team's version. And uh, he also didn't find any problem. So when I open my PowerPoint, my face will uh, disappear on screen. I'm really sorry for that. Um, today I will lecture my eyes plan, which is specific research. My topic is research on the impact of improved uh, work environment on employee satisfaction and turnover. This study is about uh, whether improving the work environment has an important impact on employee satisfaction and employee turnover. And first part is study background introduction. The idea for this research came from my former colleague who was a personal manager working for an IT company in Beijing, China. This company name is PPTV, Beijing New Product Creative Company. It operates an online video platform. <clears throat> it's similar uh, to YouTube. In my conversation with him, he pointed out that the company's current employee turnover rate is very high, and uh, its employees' work efficiency and attitude they are getting worse and worse. He suspects that this has uh, something to do with the common overtime work of Beijing IT companies and the relationship between colleagues in this in the workplace is very bad. With these questions, I start my research. <coughs> Statement of the problems. According to data in recent years, almost every IT company in China has serious overtime work. Several of China's largest internet companies, such as Tencent and Baidu, Huawei, they work overtime for several hours a day. The competition among small and medium-sized enterprises is also very fierce. Almost every employee engaged in this job is a young person. Employees who have a family and over 30 years old, they choose to start their own business or change jobs one after, after, one after another. And uh, discrimination still exists in IT companies. Female employees are considered, considered uh, uncreative, and older employees are considered difficult to manage. This may be an important reason for employees to leave or cause uncomfortable work environment. <clears throat> and my study objectives First, uh, research whether the workplace affects, affects employee satisfaction. Second, find out the variables and the independent variables that affect employee satisfaction in the work environment. Third, collect data and analysis the relationship between the variable, variables and the independent variables to prove uh, the research hypothesis and this is my research question and the research objective is does overtime affect employee productivity the impact of employee physical or productivity and part two is uh, literature review and the first is uh, I study some uh, 
uh, survey models is about my study. Is that including uh, flexible work related uh, surveys and the reason on the relationship between overtime and the productivity. Job characteristic uh, survey and the leadership style survey. And some study uh, and a letter about employee turnover rate. And after a uh, literature reveal, I build my conceptual framework. I find some independent variable that is over time leadership style and uh, cortical relations. And I find some dependent variable that is productivity, work efficiency, and the employee turnover rate. Then I start to do my previous research. And after the previous research, I I have I have uh, I have three hypothesis formation, and. Uh, one of them is uh, a good rest can increase employee productivity. When employees are tired, productivity may be reduced. And uh, H1.2, flexible work styles can increase employee engagement. And I totally have uh, six hypotheses uh, because I only have 20 minutes, so I just talk about two my hypothesis. And this part is about my research methodology. This research will use qualitative research methods to solve complex problems. Qualitative research is descriptive through uh, well-designed questions and the uh, interpretation of body language we can understand people's motivations and thoughts. So a question to be uh, surveyed in this study is closely related to the hypothesis and the analysis will be conducted by collecting data on the variables and the independent variables and finally confirm whether the hypothesis is true. Qualitative research can help researcher, researchers clarify how to collect data design problem and uh, analyze data. And the population and the simple. And since this uh, subject of the research is related to employee satisfaction, so my server objective uh, is uh, employees of this company, which is PPTV department. Uh, so design questions are based on previous research and the literature reviews, as well as the Company's reality. The scope of the simple is based on the staff of a PPTV's new project uh, department, uh, which includes 260 employees, but only um, 206 employees participated in the survey. And uh, simply design, uh, my questionnaire totally have. 26 questions divided to, into four parts. First part is about uh, descriptive analysis, is to collect uh, information, generation, generally information of employees. And uh, two part to four part is uh, about uh, collect, collect some data of employee. Uh, to, to collect uh, the data about uh, hypothesis. And this is an uh, example to collecting uh, descriptive analysis. This is uh, about gender information, like this table under the screen. And the middle of the screen, this is an example to collecting data I use a uh, Likert scale to uh, statistic uh, the score of the answer. 
uh, and data collection experiment uh, and uh, data analysis. Data collection experiment is questionnaire, and uh, I use SPSS to do data analysis because the SPSS can help uh, researchers to clear up data, convert it into related uh, graphics models so that the research can quickly process them and uh, analyze the data set. And uh, this part is about uh, data analysis. Have two parts. Uh, first is descriptive for statistics. And this, this part uh, totally have uh, six questions is to collect uh, generally information of employees. This is an example in table 4.1, gender information of employees, and uh, which can show this company have uh, more than 80% people are male, <laughs> which can reflect uh, uh, IT companies uh, is almost uh, male and just a little bit uh, are female. This will uh, uh, maybe uh, cause some problems for the company. And second part is uh, inferential statistics. And the first is uh, I will check the reliability. And this is one of the simple of uh, reliability analysis because uh, this part have a lot of uh, analysis, so I just uh, uh, pick one to uh, example. Uh, from this figure, it shows that scores of uh, alpha if item deleted are 0 0.921 to 0 0.98. It's very high level. It can know so reliability is very high. And the second part is uh, hypothesis test. I will check my six hypotheses. And this is one of the hypothesis test. And from this figure, uh, I will check the colleague relations and the employee turnover rate. This is will test uh, uh, whether a bad colleague, a bad colleague relations is uh, impact uh, in employee turnover rate. And uh, from these figures and uh, analysis, it can be seen the NOVA test and uh, SIG is more than 0 0.05. So This uh, so this hypothesis is uh, reject re rejected, and this table is the results of uh, hypothesis is including six hypothesis results, and uh, four hypothesis was accepted, and H uh, two point two and H uh, three point two are rejected. Summary and the conclusion finding. Um, for summary, this research focuses on whether the workplace has an impact on employee satisfaction and the turnover rate. Employee satisfaction is very important to the company. When employees are satisfied with the company, they will work more activity, which will bring more benefits to the company. In addition, Referring to the literature review in chapter two, when employees are dissatisfied with the company, they may cause the productivity to decline, finally take early actions, even to leave the company. The purpose of this study is to research whether improving the workplace can increase employee satisfaction and reduce employee turnover. And uh, when I uh, finish my 
reliability analysis and uh, have a sources test. I find some um, funding that is relationship. Um, uh, I mean, over time may have a negative impact on productivity. And second is leadership style is very important impact on employees' work efficiency. And uh, discrimination in the workplace has an uh, important impact on the turnover rate of employees. My study recommendations is uh, because my research only focus to the company over time situation and the leadership style and the manager uh, styles in the work environment and the college's uh, relations. But uh, I didn't study about uh, welfare and uh, sanitary conditions. So if research want to uh, study this objective can um, add some factors. And the uh, next recommendation is uh, because my study is about uh, uh, IT company. So if other um, other other kind of work maybe cannot uh, use this and uh, because this company is uh, location in PPTV Beijing and China don't have international environment and uh, I didn't collect data from employees of other companies and uh, did not conduct interviews. So if research want to do more study and uh, collect more information, maybe can uh, go to several companies to collect data, not only one company. Uh, thank you. This is my um, presentation. Thank you for listening.